So, the Holly Dash will let this power up. I wish that, you know, could load a little faster, but hey. What? What's going on? YT, YT, what's going on, man? What it do? What what's 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 popping, man? You know what I'm saying? Appreciate all the love and support that we got on the last video. <coughs> Just showing what you know the shop did to the car. Uh since then I've been going, you know what I'm saying, going through it, going through it. Uh you know what I'm saying? Just basically just trying to figure out what to do what need fix xyz and so on and so forth um i was able to get the car back running so i'll show you guys that here in a few uh we switched up a lot of things so we're gonna discuss those upcoming plans for that and yeah we're gonna get into it i ain't gonna talk boom so got the car back running the culprit of why the car had stopped running and I gotta, I'm gonna fix this. Uh, this gonna be my mission today to fix, which probably only gonna take me 30 minutes. But you guys see that pink wire right there? Well, that goes to the starter. And they spliced in, they cut it and spliced into it to provide power to this uh, distribution block right here. So I'll probably be, I'm, I know I'm gonna be fixing the splice, but I'll probably be swapping that out, making it look a lot cleaner. Um, we did go ahead, we just uh well the spark plugs were swapped out on the last video but i i got rid of it coming you know fresh off the intake uh put 90 degree elbow on there with a four inch cold air intake and then on top of that i put this uh like screen down there to you know just keep foreign objects uh while driving down the road coming up hitting it xyz uh, also, we got rid of the AC old box. I'm glad that I did that because once I took that off, oh man, it was so much stuff in there. I got some plans, maybe a vintage AC kit, maybe not. I'm still trying to decipher. Um, I know the vintage AC kit is pretty pricey, but as far as the bay, I mean, it's, 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 I want this look so sometimes you know you may have to sacrifice i don't know we're gonna see we did go ahead and uh get a stage two cam so that will be going in we got a stage two cam new oil pump new timing chain uh new push rides we got a lot of new stuff and i'm actually waiting on i'm gonna have somebody to do that portion i'm just gonna be honest about that i'm gonna have somebody to do that for me but yeah we uh I'm just waiting on him to give me a call and you know what I'm saying we're gonna get all that line back up um went ahead and got the headlights wired up as well uh got all that tucked in down there uh I mean it's it was pretty much straightforward high beams are in, um on the inside and the lows on the out these do light up red with the daytime running lights and I'll show you guys that here in a few uh what else we gotta do some work to the hood because she pretty much hanging on <laughs> so i'll be working on that today uh, what else i'm just going over the exterior right now oh these were white these straps going across were white so we went ahead i painted those black to get them to match which i'm glad that i did because now it just it looks way better <laughs> look way way better uh what else did i do added uh what do they call that mass air mass airflow sensor added that coming off the intake and yeah that's pretty much it as far as the engine bay um the interior i, di I did manage to go ahead i got that cleaned all the way out as you guys can see you know what I'm saying? We got that clean. Very, very good. Uh, I got the Holly Dash 90% wired up. Um, the only other thing is I'm just trying to configure my gauges. And once I get those gauges configured, we'll be in the game. Let me show you guys here, though. Oh, if we get in. Um, let's see. Let's turn. We're going to 
We ain't gonna crank her up. We just gonna turn her over. And as y'all know, I got the uh, detachable steering wheel. I, I keep the steering wheel in the house when I'm not outside or working on it. But, so, the Holly Dash. I'm gonna let this power up. Boop, 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 boop. I wish that, you know, could load a little faster, but hey. What? What's going on? Oh, probably. I know. I know the battery did. Oh man. Yeah. See. You hear how dead that battery is? Oh man. Yeah, it, the battery's so dead that um, it's not gonna power on. And the battery dead just because yesterday when I was working on it, just having to probe all the wires. But nevertheless, I'll sh I'm gonna show you guys that in another video. But we got the left blinkers uh, wired up. We got the right blinkers wired up. Uh, we got the fuel gauge set. Um, oh yeah, also we went ahead and put the new dash pad on, got that on, looking nice and sleek. Got this cleaned up, still working on my shifter plate. This is just a template that I got, um, that I cut out, you know what I'm saying? So we're still working on that. Well, it's, it's in there so tight. Yeah, y'all catching the drift of it though. Ass. Who knows? It's a oh hold on. I think I got it. There we go. Boom. So we're still working on the shifter template. Let me see if those lights will come on. It's so dead. Yeah, see, it just killed it just killed my battery. So but yeah. This video ain't really go as planned. <laughs> Alright, gang, so yeah, the uh, Holly Dash one cranking. We went ahead and got the jump box. <laughs> so, let me show you guys. Let me show you guys that real quick. <sighs> Alright. We open headers right now. That's why she's so loud. But... get that um that jumper on jump on the battery but yeah we got all that hooked up for sure um oh we also got a new alternator bracket to go alternator power stem bracket to go on there so we'll be getting all that installed on the car and you know what i'm saying in the meantime we'll be making um our decision as far as what we're gonna do with the ac um if i'm gonna you know go with the vintage air or if i'm gonna put the stock um box back on there which uh be just a whole clutterness over there and i really don't want that but that's pretty much where we are right now with the bill still a few things to get worked out still gotta get exhaust put on the car gonna do an axle dump um so it's, it's gonna have it dumped right before the uh the rear the rear act the the rear end I'm going to get that from speed engineering uh, as far as the axle dump. So I have the speed engineering headers and then tied into the uh, speed engineering axle dump. Um, got some rims in the house that we got to get fitted on the car. I don't know. I'm actually thinking about either keeping it stock with the stock tires and just doing like some uh, white leather tires. That's what they call those BF Goodrich or something like that get some of those i think that will actually set set this car off um yeah man that's pretty much it for as far as right now on the bill you know a lot of updates um after we do all of that of course we're gonna go in and redo the brake system make sure she got 
good stopping power. And yeah, man. Yeah. Um, I know this video one as long as the other ones. Uh, just a quick update. Mm, just wanted to get back in the groove of dropping videos um, once a week for you guys, letting you guys know, you know, what I'm saying where we are with the bill. Being that you know we did start it off that way, we might as well go ahead and finish it that way. Um, looking for a couple of people in Georgia who can do me a custom um, exhaust. Cause I know some shops they some shops don't want to do it just because they say like it's a unibody car and that type is not supposed to be on there. But you know when you're doing custom, you gotta fit that in. You feel me? But you know just a quick like I said, just a quick update, man. We're not gonna take it too long. We ain't gonna do all no extra unwanted talking. Make sure you guys um, go ahead and subscribe if you're not. Hit that like button. Share the videos good content man i'll be keeping you guys updated on the lawsuit as well once we get some more word about that and you feel me that's it so like i said like share subscribe make sure you comment show your boy some love man we at the honeycomb hideout signing out peace